I mean, from my knowledge, it might just only have Peck at that point. Greetings, one and all. I am a Sonic Geek, and welcome back to the Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke with Shadow Samus. You know, now that I think about it, the Zapdos having Peck doesn't really doesn't really give you any favors. Because that Peck's still stronger than just about anything else you could have at this point. You know, it might be a good idea to level these guys up a little bit. Probably. Reminder that you do have a third place you can go right now to catch something new. Oh, you've oh, got to be working. kidding me! You could have had that! Hey, you got a Bagon, though. Fuck Bagon. You could have had Zapdos! You could have had Zapdos! Fuck Bagon you could have had Zapdos! Zapdos. <laughs> fuck Zapdos, because it would have murdered you. Fuck Bagon and Zapdos. Typhlosion is the fucking bomb. <laughs> Typhlosion is amazing, yes! I'm... And it just did one damage. I'm upset now. Uh, level 2. Yes, yeah, so a level 2 Typhlosion. With smokescreen. Well, to be fair, it does have its first four moves because it's fully evolved. Yep. I'm all kinds of upset right now. Learned Water Gun! I well, only we can take it out quicker next time. <laughs> you can also oh, give look, your other thing some... another one. Judging by the fact that they're not only showing up at level three, I don't think this is I don't think they shuffled Cricket Hot into that. It's super effective. It's super effective again! Of course. That little Bagon probably wants some love now. <laughs> Level 7. Level 8. Level 8. Rage! And rage. We have two ragey boys. Ah! You do. They get very angry, and then they hit whatever they're facing. Yep. Could have had a fucking Typhlosion. My question is, would those two classify as Barbarians, then? Possibly. I mean, they have Rage. They do have Rage. But they can use it way more than two times. We could have had a Typhlosion. I'm kind of pissed. <laughs> I fucking love Typhlosion. Remember, not, oh, only Typhlosion. Not, only Typhlosion, not only could you have had Typhlosion, not only could you have had Typhlosion, you could have died to a Zapdos. <laughs> Count your blessings. And all it has is rage. Yeah, it gets other things later. Peck. Oh, Zapdos does have Peck. At least it's only doing three damage. Yep, all it has is back. I thought it would have had Leer or something. Just not. Alright. Hmm. Because I know this is pre Thunder Wave on this thing. Oh, it has Thunder oh. Shock! <laughs> it oh, does have something else! It only did six damage! Not taking the risk. <laughs> I mean, it could have paralyzed you. To be fair, the Bagon would have resisted it. If anyone's equipped to fight a Zapdos right now, it's that Bagon! <laughs> Although Stantler might hold its own, too. We've seen a bunch of Zapdos, we've seen two Typhlosion and one Bagon. Did I just get the rare catch for this route? Uh, considering the red catch is normally a Cricket Tot, and I think you caught that big on at level 3. And Cricket Tot's always at level 3. I think you did. Just my fucking luck. <laughs> but it's a big on. Eh, fair enough. Come in handy if we run into a dragon, Jim. Eh. 
only slightly. Because if you run into a dragon, Jim, you also have to deal with the fact that the Bagon is a dragon. Yep. Hello, Zapdos. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I'm not fighting. Let's see if it's... Let's see if it's Stantler can take down Zapdos. <laughs> I mean, if it's a level 2, you might be able to take it, but level 3 is pushing it. Yeah. Can't escape. That did 4 damage. RUN! There we go. I Hello. I wanna catch you so bad. Hello, Typhlosion. Hey, you never know, you might find Cyndaquil somewhere later. God, I hope so. <laughs> you really want a Typhlosion. I really want a Typhlosion, it's one of my favorites. I don't blame you. That's why I'm happy I found a Zubat in my, in my own Nuzlocke. <laughs> it's not very often that you hear someone say they're happy to find a Zubat, but... Considering I can evolve that thing up into a crowbat, and I know multiple things I can do oh, with a crowbat. Oh, hi, Zapdos. <laughs> yeah, it's level 3. Run. Get the hell out of there. Your Bagon's level 4, though. Yep. Ah! 3 damage. More than 3 damage. Onslow can take a hit. Yes, but can he run away from the Zapdos? Should be able to. Yep. He got out of there. I still think that Stantler of yours could take out a Zapdos on its own. Possibly. I think. It would be even more helpful because I don't know when it learns it, but I know at some point it does get Hypnosis. Making it the ideal solution at this point. <laughs> Here's the test. Remember, Stanley doesn't evolve, so it's more equipped. Yep. Speaking of which, it's level two. Hey, you big dummy! And it has intimidate. <laughs> So you're even weakening the Pex. And it's faster than a Zapdos for some reason. Three damage. Yeah, see? Three damage. And that. For what it is, it hits surprisingly hard. Well, what do you know? Also, look at that experience gain. Also, the experience gain, pretty neat. And another Typhlosion. Another Typhlosion. Well, if Stantler can take out Zapdos, I wonder. I mean, even with that Leer, it might be just fine taking it out. Speaking of Leer... As long as the next one hit, it's making, going down. Speaking of things that, make, things that are making it a little bit harder... Not hard enough. I mean, it's one stage of accuracy, it's not a huge loss. Typhlosion. God damn it, Bagon was the rare one. Like I said, it probably shuffled it probably shuffled Bagon into the Cricketot spot. Which is which is not only rare, but only found in the morning and at night. 
which, depending on what the time's set to, unless they shuffle that away. Possibly. Who knows? Smoke screen! Crit. God, that was really unnecessary. God dang oh, level five. Fucking powerhouse over here. Like I said, it doesn't evolve, so it's gonna be pretty competent right now. And can probably hold its and can probably hold its own long term too. Level two Zapdos. Well, that's gonna be dead. And intimidated. And leered. Heck. It did one damage. Well, oh, you so intimidated much. it. Oh, that was a crit. Okay. And I'm out of that. Okay, nope, yep. We're out of here. Bill! Bill! Have you tried running into anything at the lakefront yet? Uh, oh yeah! I was about to say, you can go there! Completely forgot about that. So, I mean, unless you want to wait until you can find something through surfing, it wouldn't be a bad idea to check. Let's go get us a new friend. We will see whatever you run into. And it is something normal. Ooh, Your friend is a toxic croak. Toxic Croak didn't crack my top six, but it's a pretty good one. As much as I say, Beautiful Eloy. As much as I say, Dark is my favorite type. A lot of the ones I like are actually poison. I don't know. It's regaining HP. It's regaining HP. Yep. Ooh. But I got it. Oh. Oh man. I think you just got lucky. Wouldn't be the first time. Well, if you consider that lucky. Toxic croak. Oh. Let's see. No, no, no. You really got lucky. Not even just for what you ran into. <laughs> Once you said it was restoring HP, I knew. Yeah. Poison fighting frog. <laughs> Poison fighting frog. That's exactly what it is. Fine. Sticking with my naming scheme. Shit, who would that be, though? <laughs> Get. Wait. Yes. Wait. The new friend. Nailed. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at this guy for a second. That's, That's why I said you got lucky. Look at what it's holding. Black sludge. Yep. Slightly less lucky, considering it just had anticipation. Why is that slightly less lucky? Because its other option is amazing. And what is the other option? The other option is a little thing known as dry skin. Dry skin. Twofold purpose. One, you do take more damage from fire, but you completely absorb but you completely absorb water moves and restore HP from them. Ooh. 
you take the, you do take damage in sun, but you restore HP in rain. That's kind of neat. It it it's a really good one. It's normal. And another Typhlosion. We'll just run into all the Typhlosions. Yep. I mean, it's better than running into Zapdos every time. Fair. Mud slap, baby, mud slap. I saw the name and I thought you had, I thought it said Bagon. It's like, wait a minute, why? Is, why does your Bagon look different? Well, that didn't last long. Yeah, bye. Well, you didn't heal it. I went to town. I rested up. He hit me with a crit. I thought it was because you just caught it. Yeah, it's because I just caught it that I went into town to heal. Hmm. So either you got really unlucky. I'll review that later. <laughs> Unless you got jumped on the way to town. I'm taking that black sludge, though. Black Sludge is yours. Just make sure you give it to something poison. Yep. Because I don't want to be the bearer of bad news, but anything else will get hurt by it. <laughs> Farewell, friend. You will be missed. Well, that was pointless. That was dumb luck. <clears throat> you know, here's a better question. That is? Why were, why were you going from the lakefront to Sam Gen Town to heal? I didn't. I stopped in Twin Leaf to heal. I went home yeah, to what heal. Is up with... Your luck went from amazing to horrible. Yep. Just like me! Hello, Zapdos. Oh, except there's no amazing! <laughs> now that I look at it, Zapdos looks so majestic. <laughs> Not as majestic as he could be. <laughs> He's just like. Oh. M -er. Ember versus water gun. Yep. Nice try, Typhlosion. Yep. Oh look, it's Bagon. Hello, Bagon. Bagon fight. Oh good. The old Bagon standoff. His rage is building. His rage is building even more! My god! All out war between day gods. <laughs> yep. Level up. It's almost like two bugs constantly using Fury Cutter on each other. Ooh, no except that can actually miss.
Having bite is a blessing. Yep. For a bait gun. Because now, not only do you, not only do you have consistent damage, you have a flinch chance. Yep. And it's a pretty good one. On bite. Oh, look, a spinner act. Hello, Spinarak. Do you want to be a test dummy? And it flinched. Just chomping away at that spider. Like, like I said, do you want to be a test dummy, Spinarak? And now to see what the first trainer has. I feel like I should have put Onslow up front. Hmm. You'll probably be okay. It's a poison type. Poison point. Not necessarily. Well, you know what? I don't want to find... I don't want to risk it. To be fair, the... to be fair, this is the point where you can't faint from poison outside of battle. All right. This is the starting point of that. Well, well, not this game, but this group of games. You'll just be at 1 HP. Alright. So you He's super weak, but not down. Too strong, too strong! Trainer tips. What do you got? I hope it's a ghost. I Thank really you, hope please. it's a ghost. Pidgey. It's a Pidgey. I don't. I don't think I've ever so seen a Pidgey sprite before. Hmm. The Pidgey looks pissed. <laughs> One on really top. angry bird. Angry bird. Quick, shoot it at this point. <laughs> I don't know, this point can be kind of hard to hit, it just keeps bouncing around. <laughs> Better be really careful with that slingshot. <laughs> oh look, another spinner act. I realize, I realize that Pidgey was at the level where no sand attack. I also realize that Spinner X starts with Poison Sting. <laughs> Continuing on. And another trainer battle. To this guy. <laughs> but I'm gonna win. We'll see about that. What do you got? Combi. You're never gonna win with that combi. That particular combi is useless. Why? What does it have? Uh, as in only females evolve. Oh. Apparently only has sweet scent. I mean, I think it has gust at this point, but it's not using it. And now it's too late. Yay. You beat me? You've got talent. No, I just don't use a male comb beat. <laughs> Hooray! I think, I think there was an item off to the side there. I'm not sure. Another what? Just an item. Oh. And if you shuffle those, you might get something pretty neat. Yes! 
This guy! Uh, excuse- WHAT?! How do you unmask me? Is remember the international police? Um... My it's god, the destroyed. fucking ego on this guy. I love this guy, though! <laughs> now that my cover's been blown. <laughs> Shall only, uh, I shall inform you only of my code name, Looker. Is the saying "Don't be a thief" familiar to you? <laughs> See, you say taking what belongs to others is wrong, but you set your animals to beat up their animals, and then you take their money afterwards. So, <laughs> really, it only applies to the animals. <laughs> First is recorder. You don't have to worry about that in a randomizer. Not because I'm lonely, no, no. <laughs> and then that line afterwards is the best. <laughs> okay, see so you around. Now we can finally see what that item was. After we heal. After up. healing. Awesome. Healing is healing is probably a good idea. Healing is key. Rip in peace, toxic croak. So sad. A protector. Uh, if you shuffle the if you shuffle the evolution requirements, you probably won't need that. Yep. And yeah, that's the thing that turns right on into Rhyperia, right? The protector. Normally. Oh, look, an item. Oh, candy. I'd hang on to that for a while. Yep. Why are there two town maps? <laughs> I mean, it's cool, but I don't need two. Oh, I just realized you could totally shuffle the type of type of, for the gyms too. Yep. Pretty I sure remember that's exactly a feature. That. Also, I'm pretty sure those two in there were trainers. The Poketch. Ah, yes. Oh my, you are a rare case indeed. <laughs> he says you're a rare case, but he's the inventor, so it's really just a marketing ploy. Yep. Have to go find some clowns. But you know what? We will do that next time. We'll find the clowns eventually. Eventually. Thank you guys so much for joining us. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, etc. And we will see you next time. Bye-bye.